Stu here from Spartap HQ. Going to explore the differences between the soft bottle, which is perfect for a power shower, and the firmer, harder bottle, which is perfect for a tap. Let's go. Okay, we've got a good selection of possible tap bottles or containers. We've got here a glass jam jar, we've got a metal bottle, we've got an aluminium can, and we've got a glass brown medicine bottle. So all upcycled bottles, and we're gonna just show you how to work these as a good tap. Okay, this is the soft plastic bottle selection we've got to show you today. And you can even use a three liter milk bottle, perfect for a shower. This is a two litre one. This is a juice bottle. And this had some cream in it. And you can see these are all soft. However, you leave them in the sun all day and you're gonna have a free hot power shower. Okay, these are bottle rings. Now, whether it's on a firmer bottle or a softer bottle, it's best practice to just remove the bottle rings because that way you won't have air getting in and causing a leak. So remove the bottle rings. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is put the bung in. So make sure the bung is in, and then we're gonna flip it, and we're gonna invert, and then we're gonna insert the bottle. So you just need to insert the bottles. Now, we're gonna watch what happens once we get these bottles in. One of them's a firmer, harder plastic bottle. One of them's a soft plastic milk bottle. Now let's have a look what's happening here. Okay, so the softer bottle is just forcing water out. That's perfect for a power shower. Look at the way the water's pouring out of there. And then the firmer, harder bottle, no water is coming out. Now that's perfect for a tap. So if you've got a soft bottle, expect it to just push the water out and force the water out and be a hard power shower. If you've got a firm, hard bottle, that's perfect for a tap. We're just gonna pull the bung out on the blue one. Now you can see the difference. Look at the difference in the way these two flow. The blue one's giving us a nice steady flow. The pink one is still pushing out water fast with the bung in. So why is that? Okay, because this bottle is imploding. Soft plastic bottles will implode. Hard firm bottles will not implode. So if we just pop the bung back in, this bottle's coming to a, uh, this spar tap's coming to a stop, ready to use. This bottle, on the other hand, the soft one, is forcing out water. If we want more water from there, we can just pull out the bung. If we pull out the bung, we get a big jet of water flowing out. Now that's perfect if you're having a shower, as you will see. And as, we, as that water comes out, that bottle implodes and forces it out more. So here we have a soft, two litre milk bottle, soft plastic, bung in, water pouring out in a power shower. Our showering expert is here and they're gonna demonstrate that when you pull the bung out, you have this big jet of water that just pours out, which you can use to soak, soak yourself. When you've had enough water on, you can just put the bung back in and it just keeps on powering out to, to rinse off or to wash out. The Power Shower by Spartak. Okay, here we've got that soft military bottle that's really warmed up with the sun's rays there. I'm just gonna force fit it into the Spartak like that. I'm gonna turn it, I'm gonna invert and insert. So there we are. And now look at the power shower you're getting out of that. Look at that as a power shower. That's just pouring out. If you want a bit more water, you just take that, open it up and look at that. Okay. You want to top that water, stop that water, you pop the bung in, power shower. Coming out under high pressure, uh, you can see the bottles imploding, and as it implodes, it forces out the water. So, soft bottle, power shower. Firm bottle, tap. 